You, you asked in the beginning, physicists hope aliens might carry the product of millions or billions or gazillions, as we know, <laughs> a unit of SI knowledge uh, of alien scientific thought that would catapult us unimaginably far into our quest to understand the wonderful, bizarre, violent, and beautiful cosmos. Yeah. Now, do you think that there's underlying it? I, I often feel like uh, in the embedded in the Fermi paradox is sort of a, a secret projection of religious overtones or kind of godlike powers that you're kind of a savior here right if aliens exist i mean not, you're not saying that but this is what a lot of physicists and lay people among us feel that when aliens come they're going to deliver the answers to the you know f humanity's final exam give us the theory of everything which does make an appearance here no spoiler uh but why is that why are people so convinced that they're going to be far in advance of us instead of being dolphins or slime mold or, or whatever they just happen to be teleported here in some <laughs> some intergalactic Lorcon 7, Planet Lorcon 7's science fair project. So uh, why yeah. do we think that they're going to be so advanced? They're yeah. going to save us, Daniel. Mm. They're going to be our saviors. I think a lot of people look to space, not just to aliens, but space exploration and conquest as the future. And somehow out in space, we'll leave all of our problems behind. And if you've read uh, Zach and Kelly Wienersmith's amazing book, yeah. a lot of projection there. So I think people are just sort of hopeful the same way people like move to the frontier to leave their problems behind and brought them with them right um and so i'm not sure that's really going to work out but in the case of aliens it's potentially could because you know, there's been a long time in the universe where alien civilization could have developed the ingredients for life have existed for billions of years so it's certainly possible to have ancient alien civilizations uh, your question how do we know they're going to be more advanced than us? Well, if they just exist on their planet, then who knows, right? It's just algae or dolphins or whatever. 